This Philly K, my firstborn. You made a nigga strong, you the one. This Philly Taylor. Yo, what's up, guys? So today we're gonna be learning how to do that effect that you just saw um, I did on this Josh Christopher Ball is Life video. And first, what we want to do is have your scene selected, obviously. And we're just gonna go and find what scene we want to do this to. So for me, I thought this was a perfect scene right here. So I'm gonna find where he first starts to appear on the screen. And this may happen, they might have a, they might have a cross dissolve transition. In that case, I will just go and find the part where he appears pretty solid, which to me is about right there. And I'm gonna press Command B. And then I'm gonna select the second part. We're gonna go up to edit. And then we're going to add a freeze frame like this, and then we're gonna drag up like that. I'm gonna zoom in. And I'm gonna drag the time head to the very beginning, and I'm gonna go back about 20 frames, so. So that's 20, and I'm just gonna drag this freeze frame to the time head right there. And then we're gonna go to where these two scenes meet. But on the top, that's where we'll cut it. And then we'll delete it right there. Sometimes this happens, it will cut like a little bit too far. If that's the case, just go to about right here. And then what we're gonna do next is we're gonna mask out our player right here. So we're gonna go to draw mask add a draw mask. I'm gonna zoom in just a little bit and make a nice little cut around of the player. All right, so now that we have our draw mask of the player, it should look like this, which doesn't look cool yet, but we're getting there. And we're gonna go into the effects tab over here you're gonna find cosmic looks, and then you're gonna add comic cool onto the player like this. And then in color, I'm gonna to go to black and white, and I'm actually gonna change it to maybe like yellow, no, maybe blue. And then in the whites, I may keep it that way, but let's see what yellow looks like. I think yellow looks better. And I, if I'm not mistaken, that's the color of his jersey. Yeah. So I'm going to go with blue and yellow. And then now what we're going to do is we're going to double. If you're using a MacBook Pro, you're going to double click it. And then you're going to press new compound clip. You press OK. And if you're using an iMac, you'll just right click. So now we have this. And all we're going to do is go back into mask and then drag another draw mask on like this. And we're going to go to draw mask. Well, first we're gonna to go to the first frame. Make sure you're on the first frame, it's really important. And then you're going to make a small selection like this. And then you're gonna go into keyframes on control points, open up transforms, and add keyframes on all of these as well. And then we're gonna go about two frames forward. I'm gonna drag up a little bit. I'm actually gonna take this out. And then, then we're gonna drag up to about right here. Go two frames, drag up a little bit, go two frames. And you're just gonna keep going. Two, you can go two frames, three, three frames, four frames, but just try and be consistent with whatever you choose. I'm just gonna keep going until he's completely showing. And I'm gonna drag this out just for safety. Go one, two. 
go about there. And then I'll finish it out right there. Boom. Perfect. So now when we play it back, we should have something that looks like this. This fella came, my first born. You made a nigga strong, you the one. This fella Taylor, 